Hey, there's a good boy. There's a good boy. There you go, Buster. Hey, doing good. <laughs> Hello there, guys. Welcome to my first vlog. I'm Corty. And, well, as you can probably tell, I'm kind of just moving in. Moving into the lovely village of Calmston, set in. Well, we're in the Cotswolds. Just quite literally just got here well been here for a couple of hours now currently unpacking i'm having a little break the wife's inside i'm packing some boxes i'm getting under her feet so she told me to you know get out of the way so i thought i'd bring you a little vlog while i'm out here you say hello buster hey yep just gonna stay quiet are you fair enough mate fair enough so yeah how's everyone doing um welcome so yeah, as you can tell, just moved in, looking all empty, but I'm going to say something, we've just moved from Cornwall, and this place was not cheap to buy, I'm not kidding, I'm not going to go into how much it was, but let's just say it's pretty much used a lot of our savings, and well, a lot of, my, yeah, a lot of saving to be honest, only just really managed to get the money together for sale of our old property but absolutely beautiful property as you can probably tell used to be two houses but it's been turned into one so very spacious inside maybe one day I'll give you a house tour but obviously we're on pack at the moment so that's not going to be happening for a while wait until we're all settled in um, but beautiful area I immediately wanted to move up to this way we came up here you know just for a little weekend away to the Cotswolds and fell in love with it. Really old English buildings, old cottages, really, really nice. Even you get some wildlife here. Look, got a couple of deers over there in the woods. So, birds singing away as well. I cannot go wrong. Anyway, right. So, obviously, we're currently still unpacking. In fact, I should probably get back to that before I get called slacking. So, well, in here, I've got quite a bit to still get out. Um, yeah, a lot actually, to be honest with you. So anyway, I think I'm going to get that done. Might catch up with you again afterwards. And then, I don't know, we might go for a little tour around the village. We'll show you around. And we'll go for a little walk. I've had enough of driving. It's been a long drive up the M M5. All the way from Cornwall. But, nice little truck. It's done the job beautifully. Nice spacious as well for plenty of getting plenty of stuff in the back of it, so it's been ideal. Wife drove up the Land Rover Discovery 4, quite a new model, very nice. I think it's 2011, 2021. I can't actually remember, I think it's 2011 actually. No, it's yeah, 2011, or is it 2021? Don't tell me that, cannot remember. Anyway, so I better carry on. Yep. Wife's calling, so I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later on. Okay guys, so, managed to get all the truck unloaded, nearly enough done now, as you can see I've got my nice deck chairs out, on my table, I know where I'm going to be sitting at the end of the day, be a nice cold beer, it'll be lovely, lovely summer, summer's day, I don't think you could beat that, and just joy the um, beauty of the place really, so quiet, it's really really nice, Buster seems to be loving it, he seems to have made himself at home. I um, just spoke to one of my neighbours, Derek over there, yeah, he's asking if I can move the truck, so I'll sort that out in a minute, I think, I think it might be in the way, but I think we'll get that pulled back in a bit, but the wife's giving me a letter for me to go and post, um, so you have to try and find a letter, bo post box, 
Apparently there's one down the road. She drove past on the way in or something like that. So we're going to have a look at that. Try and find that out in a minute. But, oh, I'm glad to be done. I'm not going to lie. I'm so glad to be done. Going to sit back. Obviously, so much stuff still to unpack. I've got all these boxes here to unpack as well. But they might not just get put in the house for a moment. Or we'll think about getting them unpacked over time. Because, oh, it's been enough for one day. Anyway, we'll get this. I think we should get the truck shifted back. Get out of the way. He's still here looking at the truck, so I think he's eager for me to get it moved, so yeah, let's get this moved out of the way for him. See left hand drive and go home bus. Stop following me, I don't want you to get underneath the wheels. I'm gonna run you over, go on. Go under the truck then. Run away, mate. There you go, good boy. Right. Let's get this moved backwards. Okay, so. Good thing is. Don't have to get this thing back to the um, rental company until tomorrow. So. We sort that out. In the morning. Yeah, moving out of the way now, Derek. Don't you worry about it, mate. Don't you worry. Yeah. God. Seems a nice guy, but. Already quite demanding, I've got to say that. Well, it should be good back here. I don't want to crash into my Land Rover. Cost quite a bit of money, that thing. I think here should be fine, actually. There is a shed there as well, so... Yeah, I think that'll do. Right, there we go. So I can stay there for the night. Perfect. Okay. Lovely job. Right. At least that's out of the way. Saves annoying the neighbours. Don't want to be annoying them straight away. Yeah, plenty of space. Perfect. So, I don't, well, it's good to see if Buster wants to come and join me on our little walk. Come with me, buddy. You coming? Buster. Buster, come on. Am I going to be able to trust you about your lead? Maybe. Anyway, we'll go have a look for this um, post box. Um, but also, we can go and take in the sights of the um, village as well. I mean, honestly, the area we've moved to is just its so picturesque. It's so beautiful. Couldn't ask for a better place. As soon as we saw the house go on the market, we just had to have it. I'm not going to lie. I know it was expensive, but... It was just one of those, it's a, you know, kind of a dream house. And you saw me, mate? Somewhere. He likes playing hide and seek. So, quite hard to be able to track where he is sometimes. Hey, hello, mate. I think he's going to be well behaved without the lead. Probably should have brought the lead with me, but... Oh, well, we should be good. But yeah, look at it, it's just absolutely gorgeous area. It really is so well worth moving here. Something about this, you know, the Cotswolds. I think it's obviously all these stone buildings. I'm not going to lie, they, they are my favourite type of looking building. But, oh, absolutely stunning area. Someone's taking the sights there, I see, in their hot air balloon. Don't blame them. Really don't. Absolutely gorgeous. Deers everywhere. So yeah, the, trying to get here with the truck was a bit of a pain. I had to come in a different route compared to my wife. Because, um, well, the route that she took, there's loads of low branches. And I really didn't want to cut, you know, damage the truck. So we had to come in a different way. But just look at, look at these properties. I mean, I reckon these ones here are probably worth an absolute fortune. Like I said, our, our place was very expensive. I don't really want to. I'm not going to give you the actual money because we're, we're um, kind of ashamed how much we spent, if I'm honest. It was an extortionate amount of money. It really was. But uh, I can't wait to actually call this, you know, actually get settled here. It'll be really nice. 
I am looking for work at the moment though. Um, yep, out of employment. So, hopefully something... God, he's going mad, isn't he? Something will turn up, hopefully. So I've seen this place on the um, pictures. This is called the old house. Um, it's like old stable block or something. I mean, really, really good looking property. Let's just sit. It's here then. Oh, help wanted. Farm hand inquire within. Oh, okay. That sounds quite interesting. I'm not going to lie. Hmm. Well, I think I'm going to have a think about that because I mean, if I can get some work local, that'd be really, really good. Yeah. I have a chat to the wife. I've never really done a farming, so it's going to be quite a cool thing to try and get into. Obviously, mainly well, around here, as you can tell, it's just farmlands everywhere, isn't it? It's just fields. So a nice little job like that. Brilliant. Oh, such a beautiful day. Warm, though. Anyway, hit found the little box. So we'll get this put in here. There we go. Just keep the wife happy. Oh, they really load down these. Have a little look. Oh, mobility scooter out for sale, I see. Someone's selling a car. Fair few events. So, obviously we did a little bit of research in this place. And they seem... Hey, Buster. <laughs> I'm sitting there patiently. Good boy. Um, but yeah, they seem to do like horse events around here. My wife seems to be very interested in that. Yeah, I'm have to go and check that out tomorrow. Yeah, I might go have give them a visit. But yeah, she seems very interested in doing the horses. So obviously, I haven't got a horse at the moment, so we might end up having to find one for her. But then it's trying to find somewhere that we can actually keep the horse as well. But. Yeah, we'll have another walk back up here. They're growing some veg. Is that probably like beans, isn't it? Yeah, I would have thought that is beans. So yeah, we'll go. Have a look into that at some point. I might I'm surprise her for her birthday. Her birthday's coming up at some point. Very soon, so. I'll have to have a look into that. But, oh man. I love this place. It's a really nice place to cool home. Morning buddy, you alright? How's things going alright? Good man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just moved into the area, yeah. Yeah, yeah, name's Courty. Nice to meet you mate, nice to meet you. Also, oh, just recording, yeah. Yeah, I do, I am I just started doing some videos on YouTube. I thought they'll show off this countryside, you know? Really nice place, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I'll let you get on, mate. Alright. Alright, cheers. Nice guy. Anyway, right, yeah. So, yeah, we've got a nice old area. It really is. I mean, you could just go for walks here. Whoa, hello, dear. Hosta. No. No. Right. Yeah, cab up truck up here then. Gosh, it is everywhere. But yeah, there must be quite a few um, footpaths around this area of the fort. Pretty cool. Got a little hike somewhere to look into them. This is a farm up here. So I wonder if this is the farm that's after a hand. Very quiet here today, though. Don't see really much going on. Anyway, I think actually I better get back. My wife's not going to be very happy that I'm going off for having a walk about. She's stuck at home packing, uh, unpacking. Sorry, too. So. Right, come on, Buster, let's go. Let's get back home. Go and keep her happy. The best thing, isn't it? Right, I'll meet you guys back there. I'll see you in a bit. Oh, 
Right, okay then guys, I'm nearly back now. I just realised though that I forgot to lock the truck up, so I thought I'd quickly do that now as we're passing, so we'll get that done. Right, there we go. Right, I deal. Alright, come on Buster. Let's go and get the rest of the unpacking done. I suppose that's the best thing to do. Can't let the wife do it all, can we? Anyway, so anyway, yeah, um, I think I'm going to call it there then, guys. Just a little quick vlog today. You know, I just wanted to kind of bring you guys along and just take in the beauty of this place. Cause it's just so, so nice. But I'm going to have to get up to the packing. Buster's going to come and help, ain't you, Buster? Yeah, you going to come and help us? Are you going to say, you going to say hello, say goodbye to everyone? Hey? Yeah, all around. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you ever so much for checking me out. Thank you for coming in and checking out my video. Um, if you did like today's video, then please do give it a like. Um, but other than that, I hope to see you guys again soon. I hope it's been, hope you've been enjoyable for everyone. So I'll see you later. Goodbye. Yes, I'm coming.